Hello kids! Today we're going to learn about the English 4, Quarter 3, Week 5 with the topic Using Appropriate Graphic Organizer in Text Red. At the end of this lesson, you are expected to Use Appropriate Graphic Organizer in Text Red. Kids, let me remind you that you can press the pause button if necessary. Let's have a drill! I am going to read a story, then write the sequence of events in the graphic organizer. Choose your answers inside the boxes. The Man and the Cat One day, a man was walking by a road when he heard the cat meowing from the bushes nearby. The cat was stuck and needed help getting out. When the man reached out, the cat got scared and scratched the man. The man screamed in pain but didn't back down. He tried again and again, even as the cat continued to scratch his hands. Another passerby saw this and said, Just let it be. The cat will find a way to come out later. The man didn't pay heed, but tried until he helped the cat. Once he let the cat free, he told the other man, The cat is an animal, and its instincts make him scratch and attack. I am a human, and my instincts make me compassionate and kind. Sequence the events in the graphic organizer. Choose your answers inside the boxes. You have two minutes to answer this sit work. Are you done? Let's answer. First, one day, a man was walking and heard a cat meowing stuck from the bushes nearby. Next, when the man reached out, the cat got scared and scratched the man. Then, the man didn't pay heed but tried until he helped the cat and let it free. Finally, the man was able to let the cat free. Did you get it all correct? Read and understand the details of the story. Identify the main idea and the supporting details. You have two minutes to do this review.
Here are the answers. It's story time! Are you ready to listen? Before I read the story, let us look at the picture. What can you say about it? How about the two kids? The title of the story is The Flower Garden. Rox and Ritz are twins. They thought gardening is the best thing to do during the quarantine when the pandemic happened. So, they started planting different kinds of flowers. They have a beautiful flower garden. They water their plants every day. They were able to grow many flowers. The flowers are of different kinds and variety of colors. They have red, white, and pink roses. There are daisy, santan, and sunflower too. Many of them are fragrant. No wonder butterflies and bees hover around the garden. With their wings glistening against the sunshine, indeed the twins' garden is an attractive spot to behold. Who are the characters in the story? Where does the story happen? What did they think is the best thing to do during pandemic? What do they start planting? How do the twins take care of their plants? Let us write your answers inside the graphic organizer. The characters are rocks and reeds. The setting in the garden. The beginning of the story is they thought gardening is the best thing to do during the quarantine when the pandemic happened. The middle of the story is they started planting different kinds of flowers. The ending of the story is they water their plants every day. They were able to grow many flowers. What we did earlier is an example of a graphic organizer. What are graphic organizers? They are visual charts to organize students' ideas. They help them map out ideas. They can help plot character details. They can also help plot the setting of the story. They can help students make comparisons and contrasts. And they can also help develop other ideas in detail. One example of a graphic organizer is a Venn diagram. It compares and contrasts two concepts. Another example is a story map. It is to learn the elements of a book or story easily. The third example is the sequence graphic organizer. It shows a series of steps or events in the order in which they take place. Let us see if you understand our lesson. Read and understand the poem and fill out the events needed in the graphic organizer. Hira, the Honest Girl Hira found a wallet while she was at the market. Honest as she is, she gave it to the police. Little girl, where did you find this? Come, have a seat in my office. Oh, there is no name on it, said the police. We don't know whom to return this. Hira answers, You're right. We need to return this tonight. It's still broad daylight. I hope we can find the owner before midnight. Sequence the events happened in the poem. Use the graphic organizer below. Choose your answer inside the post-it. You have two minutes to answer this.
Let's answer. 1. Hira found a wallet while she was at the market. 2. She gave the wallet to the police. 3. But the police said there's no name on it. 4. Hira answered, we need to wait before midnight. Did you get it all correct? Let's have practice number two. Read the paragraph and then write how the ideas are similar and different using the Venn diagram. The twins. Jane and Jam are twins. They both like wearing dresses. They like to eat foods prepared by their mother. Jane likes chocolates. Jam loves to eat pasta. Their mother cooks two kinds of foods for snacks. Jane loves chocolate cake, while Jam likes spaghetti. One day, their mother got sick and cannot cook food. The two twins tried to cook boiled egg for snacks. You can now cook by your own, said mother. What do the twins have in common? Write your answers in the similarities. What do they differ? Write in the first circle for Jane's likes and in the second circle for Jam's likes. Choose your answers inside the box. You have two minutes to answer this exercise. Here are the answers. For the evaluation, read and understand the short story. Identify the elements of the story by filling the graphic organizer. Paul and the Eggs Pete the grasshopper and his friend Paul the praying mantis were playing in the garden. One day, they found some round small objects in the grass. Paul wanted to play with them because they looked like small balls. He was about to pick them up when Pete stopped him. Those are not playthings. They look like small eggs, Pete said. No, they are not eggs. I am going to play with these balls, Paul insisted. He got two and prepared to throw them. Suddenly, they broke and came little bugs. Paul was surprised. Oh, they are alive, he said as each one ran away. 
Pete laughed at the frightened paw. See, I told you. Look at the elements of the story. Identify which is the setting, characters of the story, problem of the story, and the solution. Choose your answers inside the flowers. You have two minutes to finish this. Here are the answers. Setting in the garden. Characters, Pete and Paul. Problem, they found some round small objects in the grass. Paul wanted to play with them. Solution, Pete stopped Paul and told him, those are not playthings. What's your score? I hope you got them all correct. Thank you for your time. I hope you enjoy our lesson for this week. See you next week.